All right, ladies and gentlemen, Fab's in the house. And today I have a really cool fidget spinner here with me. This is the Custom Knife Factory Pepiaka 4.0. Uh, Custom Knife Factory is a company out of Russia. They design mainly knives, uh, but they also do really cool spinners. And today we're going to have a look at the visual, uh, auditory and kinesthetic aspect of this spinner here. So visually, this is one of the coolest looking fidget spinners uh, out there. The design is uh, really, really appealing. It's beautiful. It, uh, it resembles like a flying, an identified flying object. Uh, it's, uh, it's a flying disc, of course, when it spins and uh, just straight out from the future. And I really, I really love the design. Uh, they didn't cheap out in the materials here. You can see they used the uh, Timascus. So Timascus is a uh, Damascus made out of uh, two different uh, titanium alloys. And as you can see, you can uh, appreciate all the layers uh, welded in these inlays. Uh, with this beautiful blue color, they create a really, really interesting contrast with the gold anodized titanium buttons, both sides, I mean, Truly, truly spectacular work here. Every single arm has um, several pieces, like you can see the buttons here, two inlays, these two pieces of steel, there's a tritium uh, vial inserted uh, on the edge. So basically like seven pieces per arm, it's already 21 pieces. Then you have the buttons, the vials, the skeleton, the bearing, the ball bearings. You have a washer holding in place the bearing. I mean, this is a 27 pieces puzzle, like beautifully machined titanium. It's uh, just incredible. Uh, it's, it is really well, well thought uh, designed throughout. Um, I mean, the, just, just look at this. This is pure perfection. It's shiny, there's a matte area, beautiful contrast here. These grooves are incredibly beautiful. And also in the back, you see there's, there's no logo in the back, only right here. And these grooves are just, they, there's you know, a little gap here and they continue on the outside. It's just, just phenomenal. Uh, of course, the, these vials are uh, glowing in the dark, so you're gonna have a really cool effect around uh, the the spinner while spinning in the when the lights are off and um, of course this is a numbered edition there's uh, 166 of these made so it's, uh, it's a sprint run let's say and um, one really cool thing of the design is that you have mainly two uh, two main colors like the the gold and the, and the blue and when it spins uh, you, you can create like two different rings of light um, spinning around the, the button. Uh, you cannot appreciate it very well now because you are shooting 24 uh, frame per second, but it's, uh, it's uh, incredible. Like in, in person, you can change the axis as you uh, spin, the um, change the axis, the angle of incidence of the light will change and will hit the spinner in a, with a different angle. So the ring is going to move around it, it's just just you know easier to to see than to explain um the the noise that this spinner makes is uh, very very quiet really really uh, low compared to the pepiaka 3.0 in fact they changed the bearings and they uh, achieved a really high level of uh, amazingness if we can say that and uh, you can appreciate the sound really quiet, really unobtrusive. You can easily watch a movie and just spin this guy between your fingers. Nobody will notice because if you don't reach like high round per minute, like in when you spin it with two fingers and you reach like this noise, if you just use one hand, you're going to reach a, a quieter noise because it's going to spin slower. 
so it's very very quiet um, if you like to spin it on the table it's still really quiet but of course louder because it's gonna produce this hissing kind of sound and if you push the button you see you can hear that uh, the pitch uh, increases a little bit but yeah I mean nothing nothing crazy um, one uh, really really cool aspect of this one is the feeling I mean the action you have with spinning by spinning this guy is really really nice um, it's not lightweight it's not like super heavy but it's it has a really nice heft to it so it gives you the the sensation that you are holding something first of all valuable and then pretty solid there's like re very little play here and it's well constructed well built well designed so you you have the the feeling that you didn't waste your money because guys this is not a, a cheap uh, spinner um when you when you spin it you know because the buttons are concave you're gonna have very very nice grip between your fingers so you can hold it nicely and the, these grooves are gonna give you you know that 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 pleasant grip uh that little traction you know when if you want to like spin it uh, faster or stronger so you you can safely hold it and have you know a, a, a really nice feeling and especially when you move the axis oh man the feedback you receive is is gorgeous is something it's like uh, you know you feel the force that because of the gyroscopic effect uh, pulling uh, your fingers is it's really really pleasant i think in the vertical position is uh, the sound is quieter than the horizontal position but i prefer this one in the horizontal position because you can easily balance this one on your finger there's no wobble and you know something you cannot do in the vertical position uh, but i really like holding it like this you know spinning with my middle finger like this you know you just have traction here because it's beautifully designed so your finger is just pulling back you can you can spin it in the front i prefer in the back you can also do you know hold it between the middle finger the thumb and just use your index to flick it in the front to flick it in the back i mean you have a few different ways to to play with this and to receive lots of joy and just fidgeting with this beautiful object and all right guys there you have it this is my review of the pepiaka 4.0 by custom knife factory hope you guys enjoyed the video thanks for watching and stay tuned